Hello. Today I'd like to review with you a procedure known as interstitial seed prostate brachytherapy. This is an outpatient procedure that takes about 45 to 60 minutes to complete. You'll be given the exact time of your procedure, generally one to two days before your procedure date. In preparation for your procedure, you will be given some prescriptions. The first is Tamsulosin. You'll start that medicine one to two weeks prior to your procedure. You'll also be given an antibiotic prescription, which you will start after your procedure when you go home. You may also be given a prescription for urinary burning and for pain. You'll also need to do a bowel prep prior to the procedure. That will consist of starting a clear liquid diet about 24 hours before your procedure. You'll also need to do a fleet cinema the night before and the morning of your procedure. On the day of your procedure, an IV will be placed in the pre-op clinic area. You'll then be taken back to the operating room and placed on your back. You'll then be placed under anesthesia. And once you're asleep, a urinary catheter will be placed in the bladder. The legs will also be placed in stirrups and an ultrasound probe will be placed in the rectum. A template grid will be fixed to the probe and that will go up against the skin between the scrotum and the anus. That area is called the perineum. 18 gauge needles, which are about the same size we use to draw blood or place IVs, are placed through the template grid, through the perineal skin, and into the prostate. The needles are arranged in a circle on the inside edge of the prostate, spaced about one centimeter apart. If you can imagine looking at a clock face, where the numbers one through 12 lie on the clock face is about where the needles will be placed within the prostate. A few more needles would be placed within the prostate itself and once the needle positions are established, the radioactive seeds will be placed through the needles and into the prostate. As each needle is withdrawn, a train of seeds will be dropped within that needle track along the length of the prostate. Once all the seeds are in and all the needles are out, the procedure is completed. The urinary catheter will then be removed and you'll be taken to the recovery area. It takes about 15 to 20 minutes to wake up from the anesthesia and within about an hour after that, you can go home. I do recommend that you take it easy for a few days after your procedure. You may also notice some blood in the urine. And if you do, do drink plenty of water to keep the bladder flushed out to prevent any clot formation. Also remember to start those antibiotic pills. I would also avoid any bicycle riding, motorcycle riding, or similar activities for at least three to five days after your procedure. You'll be scheduled for a one month follow-up appointment in the Radiation Oncology Clinic for follow-up. If you have any further questions, please feel free to reach out to your nurse or your physician. Thanks for your attention and have a great day.